Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Today's Tuesday. Well, guys, I am just doing some much needed housework. I have dishes, laundry. I need to clean the floors. Um, we need to hurry and get out of here. We, um, I need to go to the post office to send two things that just sold on eBay. One is my camera. Not this one, obviously. I would never give you up, baby. Um, wow. Uh, yeah, so I sold my Panasonic Lumix camera and I sold some boots that I've never worn. And I'm really, really sad because I mean, I didn't really want to give this camera up. It's right here. But the thing is, I just, I don't use it like ever. And it really doesn't even work well for vlogging for me at least, just because I can't tell if I'm in focus or not. So it was just silly. I don't like hoarding things like at all. And I do it, but I don't like it. So, you know, if I can make some money on things, then I feel like I should. It is 10.40. And I actually, Hans and I are talking about signing Alistair up for a preschool program at our local community center. And it's a really good community center. It's actually where Alistair did soccer. But we are talking about signing him up to do a preschool that would be once a week and three hours a day, I'm pretty sure. And he would be going with his friend Asa that you guys see sometimes um, who comes to the preschool that we do at our house. But anyway, so if we did that, we would still do the preschool here too. So Alistair just doesn't do well being away from me. And yes, I know, some of you are gonna be like, well, you need to push it on him or something like that. But no, I'm uh, Hans and I aren't pushy parents like that. Um, I know at some point there's going to be certain things that we have to push him to do, probably, but pushing him to do things that he like really, really feels uncomfortable with, I can't do it because I was exactly like he was when he was a kid, and I remember still my mom dropping me off at my grandma's house to be babysat while she worked, um, and I just, I seriously had anxiety as a little kid, and I would just cry and cry the whole time. I would run out of the house, well, one time I got past my grandma and ran out of the house running after my mom's car. How terrible for my mom. And then and then even going to school. I would lie and say that I peed my pants all the time just so I could see my mom. It was like the separation anxiety that I had. And I mean, of course I had to be in school, especially in elementary school because that's how old I was when I was doing when I was like still so sad to be away from her, but I just remember that and I remember being heartbroken and hating to be away from her and so it's just hard for me to push those type of situations on Alistair. Um, but you know, I turned out fine. It's not, I mean, I feel like some people are like, they'll say that you need to push those situations and like they'll just have to cry it out and get used to being away from you at some point. But he will at some point, and I did at some point, and you know, it's not a big deal. So anyways, that's my rant for the day. And yeah, so we gotta get finished here, just like always, and get out of the house. We are ready to go in there to Fred Meyer, you couldn't even see that, <laughs> to get groceries. So we're going to just get a few groceries today, and I think tonight I'm making a crispy chicken salad. You ready to go in? Your hair kinda looks like you're a peacock. Okay, we're home. We got groceries. You guys want to see how fast I can move? Let's put these away. I'm cool, mom. Let's go. Let's do this. So I think that we decided that we are going to sign Alistair up for the community center preschool, but I totally misunderstood and I was thinking that it was starting like next month, but it's just registration is happening this month, like um, in a few days it's open to the public and um, it doesn't actually start until August, but you have to get signed up like this far in advance. So yeah, we're going to do it. Um, it's pretty inexpensive as far as preschool prices go. And so that will be great because that will kind of get us out of the house early 
and also it's going to be really nice because it's going to give me just a little bit of a break and it's going to be great for Alistair. But my friend Nicole um, just really assured me and talked to me a little bit today about how um, wonderful the teachers are there and she assured me like if your child's crying and they're really not going to stop crying they call the parent and they don't just like let your kid cry it out which I knew my friend Nicole would never like send her kid somewhere where her kid would cry yeah so anyways all of that made me feel a little bit better and I know in the end it's going to be really really good for Allie to be away from me a little bit and have to listen to you know other adults but um, yeah, I was just a little bit nervous about the whole idea, but I'm really, really excited for it. And um, it's kind of a bummer that <laughs> you have to sign up now and then wait till August, but that's how it goes because the community center um, preschool is pretty affordable and everyone like wants to get their kids into it and it's like a really good program. So figured I would just let you guys know. And yeah, I just put the groceries away as you saw. Alistair is going to the bathroom and weird I can see a car in the um, window reflection and it just looked like it was creeping by but I guess they're just parking right in front of the mailboxes anyways I'm gonna get him down for a nap and then I probably see you guys when I'm making dinner guys I just appreciate you so much that I just wanted to give you some flowers Okay, I'm a door. Making dinner, making the salad, and this is such an easy meal. So I will, um, I'll put the recipe down below because once you guys see the final product, you're probably gonna wanna make it. <laughs> with all the lovely goodness on there, some bread and strawberries. Gonna eat. All right, guys. I'm going to say good night right now. Um, I just got tomorrow's dinner prepped in the crock pot. I like to do it the night before so that I can start it in the morning and not have any excuses. Um, it's going to be Zupa Toscana soup. Really excited for that. And then I actually have a huge mess. I just cleaned out the refrigerator, but I still have to like get rid of all the food. So uh, like uh, all of, yeah, it doesn't even look like as much as it really is, but it's a lot. I haven't cleaned out the fridge in a while and we have wasted a ton of food, which kind of sucks. So yeah, I have some cleaning to do and then we're going to get Allie into bed. So we will see you guys in the next vlog. Still eating dinner. Hans has a headache. Ali, you want to say good night? First kiss, do you want to see my train dance on the couch? Um, they probably will see your train dance tomorrow since you're eating. Do you want to sing a song for them? I'm good night. Guys, I had to come back on here really quick just to share this moment with you guys. Alistair and I are watching Ben and Holly's Kingdom. Um, right now and we are cuddling Alistair we we're just getting ready to go into bed and Alistair said mommy will you please cuddle with me on the couch for a little bit and I feel like you just have to cherish these moments and savor them and oh you're trying to give me a kiss anyways guys that's all so have a good night